Good evening, here's our top story. Chris Christie's brother says that despite pressure from Republican leaders, the New Jersey governor is not running for president. Or running at all. <laughs> Florida has thrown the GOP nomination process into disarray by moving its primary to January 31st. Officials were required to do so under Florida's state policy to screw up every single presidential election. <laughs> A new poll of the Republican presidential race shows that Rick Perry has taken a steep fall out of first place. Perry fell so quickly from the big lead that next season he is going to play for the Boston Red Sox. <laughs> Speaking of the Red Sox, the team missed the playoffs and set the record for the worst September collapse in Major League history. Boston hasn't seen a collapse this bad since the last time Ted Kennedy staggered out of a bar. <laughs> NASA has announced plans to return astronauts to orbit by developing new transportation known as space taxis. And like all other taxis, the drivers will be aliens. <laughs> King Abdullah of Saudi Arabia announced that women in his country will now have the right to vote. The first thing Saudi women are expected to vote for, less stonings. <laughs> Among the nominees announced this week for the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame are Joan Jett and the Blackhearts, commented Joan Jett. Man, I'm just really, you know, appreciative that they honored my music. You know, the nominations in honor, all my songs that I did, like, um, you know, I Will Rock and Roll, and um, all the other songs that I did, <laughs> like, uh, Put Another Dime in the Juice. <laughs> That's the same song. <laughs> I did a lot of great music. Grace had a nipple slip while performing on Monday's Dancing with the Stars. The incident caused Google searches for Nancy Grace nipple to stay constant at zero. <laughs> and now where hard news meets Hollywood here with the entertainment news is our own Cosmo Coenga. <laughs> for a younger woman, which narrows it down to pretty much any other woman. <laughs> Children are more likely to die from heart problems than dads. 
However, men with children are more likely to die from having the life sucked out of them slowly but surely each and every miserable fucking day. <laughs> shop lost most of its business after an employee dressed as an ice cream cone was mistaken for a member of the Ku Klux Klan. <laughs> Said the store owner, I am so sorry for our mascot. From now on to advertise, I'm just gonna stand in front of the store and yell out our ingredients. Sugar, heavy cream, and malted white powder, white powder, white powder, white powder. White powder. And now, with an in-depth look at one of the week's biggest stories, it is a segment that's twice as important as AC360, it's TSW 720. <laughs>